Hello, this is Lakshmi Kantiwari. Today we are going to uh, simulate a LED blinking in a Proteus. So first of all that, press the P on the keyboard or you can press here. Okay, then select the LED. Let's take the LED from here. Fine. Okay, take the this one animated LED, put it here, and then you need a register. Fine, a register device. Okay, good, and then you must need a power ground. Connect it together and connect registers with the LED. Since LED is a current device and the LED needs at least 1, 1 milliampere to 10 milliampere a nominal LED current. Suppose that we are giving here a 5 volt source so that for 1 kilo ohm resistor the total current will be 5 milliampere. Okay. So put here a 1 kilo ohm resistor that will be 1k. And then select a source here and it is a, it will be a pulse source. Connect this pulse source to the register 1k register and let's change the property of the pulse. So the pulse high voltage must be the 5 volt. Start second is 0 that is fine don't change other things and we may change the frequency that is the 1 hertz frequency that means it will uh, blink at the rate of the 1 hertz uh, we may make it 0 0.5 hertz okay okay now just run it from here fine you can see it now it is blinking the 0 0.5 hertz frequency that's mean it will be high for one second and it will be low for one second so the total period will be the 2 seconds that means the frequency is 0 0.5 hertz. Now there are other methods ok. Let's try another method to blink the LED using an inverter uh, made by the transistors. So search a first transistor from here from a device find from the library find the part from the library let's take a NPN register BC547 is the NPN register bipolar ok and uh, now the implement now delete sorry delete it delete this wire delete this wire and uh, rotate it So this one is the RC register and uh, let's take another register put it here for a base okay and uh, sorry sorry delete this wire okay and uh, LED must be in between somewhere here or uh, we may place a LED here so what we can do here uh, we can do uh, we can place LED here ok drag it here sorry sorry connect the LED with the transistors and the ground then what we can do here uh, we can give this pulse to the input ok fine and let's give a power VCC here and uh, it must be the 5 volt uh, it can be 5 volt or less than 5 volt let's uh, um, make it a standard power supply the 5 volt now let's uh, uh, decide the resistors here 
suppose that if this transistor is running into the deep saturation that's when the voltage drop between the collector to the emitter will be the 0.2 volt so there will be a voltage difference between this resistor is 5 minus 0.2 that is the 4.8 volt so the total current will flow through this transistor is a 4.8 milliampere so what we can do uh, we can make it a 470 ohm resistor 470 ohm and uh, okay you can we can make it a 10k so the current the base current will be the very less so how we will decide the base current the base current will be the maximum voltage minus 0.7 volt okay and then there will be 0.7 volt for LED so 1.4 volt so the 5 volt minus 1.4 volt upon a 10k will be a base resistor so we can increase it to the make it a 100k so it will now draw the very low base current now what we need we need to run it okay see here now it is blinking in the same way but right uh, but this time uh, it is working with a inverter transistor uh, with the inverter made by the BC5547 NPN transistor thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next tutorial